Sometimes when we capture a photo, we may want to make a gradual adjustment. This is particularly true with landscape photography. It's often much more interesting if the sky has a little gradation or if there's a gentle lightning as we get towards the center of the focal plane. Let's go ahead here and make an adjustment. With this image, I like it and it's pretty much right in camera. I'll click auto to balance it out a bit and that looks pretty good. But what I'd like to see is a little bit of gradation. Lightroom offers some pretty cool tools. If you come up here, you could check and choose the graduated filter. This is gonna allow you to make a change. What I wanna do is set it so that change pulls down the exposure slightly. Now I can click and drag from the top. And you see how that creates a little bit of gradation in the sky. Now, I think that exposure change is a little bit aggressive. So let's set that to about negative one, but have it not be so aggressive on the highlights. There we go. And leave the whites alone. We'll do the same sort of adjustment here across the bottom. And if we want to, we could tweak that a little bit. For example, putting a little more color into the lake. If you need to, you can always click on something to select it and further refine. So I'll put a little more color into the top of the sky there as well. If we look at that side by side, what you're gonna see is a nice change. Just click to exit that tool and now you're back to your regular comparisons. Notice how we've evened out the exposure, but have a nice gradation from top to bottom and bottom to top. It just guides us into the photo. So where the picture was a little bit flat before, now there's a little bit of visual interest and it's pulling the eye in nicely. Now, portrait photographers will often do this using the vignette tool. The challenge with vignettes on landscapes is you get darkening that you may not want and it's often in the shape of more of an oval. By using the graduated, you could do the same sort of thing you would do in camera by using a graduated filter, which is very useful when you need to recover the sky and balance it out with the foreground objects.